He came from the gold city of Charters Towers, worked in the beautiful coastal town of Townsville. Hugh Quinn joined the AIF and became commander of C Company, 15 Battalion, and landed on the Gallipoli shores on the 26th of April. On the 29th, Hugh was ordered to hold a position at the head of Monash Valley. It rose 46 metres above the valley of all positions held by Australians in all wars. This was the most dangerous. Ten yards from the Turk trenches, an attack was ordered. Twice Hugh was seen to put the whistle to his lips to signal his men to go over. Twice he changed his mind. Before he would order his men to go over, Hugh Quinn would go himself. A Turkish bullet took Hugh when he reached the trenches. He's now buried in the valley near the place that will forever bear his name, Quinn's Post. <laughs>